Hi, everyone. My name is Dr. Ngozi Adeleye, the creator, founder, and facilitator of Crunch Econometrics videos on YouTube and on the Teachable platform. I also teach economics and econometrics at the University of Lincoln in the UK. So many people are aware of Crunch Econometrics videos on YouTube, and I'm grateful for all the subscribers, for my viewers, and for my critics. As of today on YouTube, I have over 33,000 subscribers, and my videos have been viewed over 4 million times. But this video, which I'm creating now, is to showcase the platform called Teachable, where I also upload some premium videos, which will be mostly useful for anyone on the postgraduate program, lecturers, anybody writing a manuscript across different cadres on the research stream whether you are a beginner researcher, a middle-level researcher, or an advanced-level researcher, you are going to find videos on Teachable very, very useful. I titled the videos Practical Econometrics for Researchers, Beginners, and Advanced-Level Users. For short, I named it PEBA. So what is PEBA all about? PEBA is strictly about hands-on applied econometrics. Similar to what I do on YouTube, I also engage my enrollees and users in a do-as-I-do approach. So I'm going to clarify who an enrollee is and who a user is. Now, the videos on PEBA covers different topics from a beginner category, and I gradually move you towards advanced econometrics using practical real-life applications. My goal or my intention is to enable you to be able to finish your dissertation, your manuscripts, finish them with ease, and also be able to interpret your results with greater confidence. That is the goal. So these are premium videos that you cannot afford to miss. So if a master student, please move closer. If a doctoral student, please lend me your ears. If a fellow lecturer like myself, or you are a researcher on any cadre, beginner, Middle level, advanced, please move closer. See what I have to show you. You need to be in my PEVA class, I tell you. I need to showcase the videos I have here. Then you will agree with me that you need to understand these techniques so that you can improve the quality of your dissertation, improve the quality of your thesis, and also improve the quality of that manuscript you are writing right now. Now, let me delve further. Still on my page, on the home page. If I move closer, you will see that you will need to enroll into my PEBA course with just a meager amount of $200. This is a one-off payment, one-time payment, and you are going to have access to all the videos published in the, on the, in the Teachable School. No more extra. This is not a recurring payment. It's one-off, $200. As at now, I have 85, 85 videos. Yes, 85 videos. And my intention is to create as much as 150 videos. So whether you have, um, you pay $200, you are going to have access to all the videos published in this school. Okay. So, and you will agree with me that this is quite uh, a discounted amount, $200 for all the videos compared to when you go for paid webinars, you are going to pay so much more and they may not even give you the quality of what I'm going to give you on this platform. Okay. I said I was going to distinguish between an enrollee and a user. An enrollee is the person that buys the course, that pays $200. This $200 is um, exclusive of tax, okay? And payment goes to Teachable, doesn't come to me. So Teachable takes the payment, do their back-end deductions, and pay me whatever is left, okay? So the old amount does not come to me. <laughs> it doesn't come to me, okay? So Teachable takes their parts and they just give me whatever is left. So this $200 is exclusive of tax, exclusive of tax, all right? So like I said, an enrollee is the person that buys the course, while a user is the person that just signs up to watch the free videos on the platform. So if you want to be a user, it's fine. Sign up, be a user, and you have access to I think about 10 videos that you can watch for free. But if you decide to upgrade and be an enrollee, then you have access to all the videos that has been published and also those that will be eventually published in the school. 
So now let me take you to the topics that I've covered or show you the videos that I have already on the platform. So here we have. So if you look at this, you will be seeing, um, you can see crunch econometrics right here, practical econometrics for research, blah, 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 and like that. So this is my own page as the admin, as the curator, as the creator. So this is my page. You may see something else, you know, as, um, as a guest or as a student. But this is my own page. It may be slightly different from yours. So let me just give you um, a sneak peek of what I have. So you can see free to watch videos here. So once you become a user, you can watch these free videos. Okay. So you can see public preview. So anyone you see public preview, it shows that um, once you sign up, you can watch these videos for free. So it shows how you can import data from Excel to Stata to eViews. Um, I have videos on limited dependent variables, how to estimate LPM in Stata and eViews. You have them so you can watch all this for free. So again, whenever you see public preview, it shows that these are free to watch videos. So let's go down again. So here I have resource for students and researchers. Okay. So these ones are all locked. You can see they are all locked. So you need to enroll for you to watch these ones. So once you don't see public preview, it shows that that video is locked. Let's scroll down again. Here I have logit and probit. And I did a lot of work in this uh, category of a, of a technique. So I have logistic model in eViews. You can see logit again in Stata. I have probit. I have probit right here, Stata and eViews. I have the goodness of it in logit and probit. And I have a comparison of the three techniques, LPM, logit and probit. So for logit and probit, you can see it's also locked. So only enrollees can watch. Okay. Next, I have ordered probit, OPM, ordered probit. And you can see introduction to ordered probit, uh, in Stata because I couldn't get ordered probit in eView. So you can only see ordered probit in Stata. Again, locked. Only the enrollees can watch this. Once they enroll, they will have access to those. I also have here multinomial logits and probits. You can see the videos here. Intro to multinomial logits and probits. You have a detailed enough to guide you to follow the technique and do a good job on your thesis if you are using this technique. I have panel bar GMM for those who are interested in this. It's also locked. So enrollees will have access to this. You can see PVA GMM in Stata. I'm not sure whether I have um, EVU's version. So I couldn't get any eViews code, so I only have it in Stata. So there you have it, Piva. Then I have models and functional forms. This is really, really interesting for you to know how to specify um, your model and how to interpret if you have level, 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 log, 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 level. You know, that's kind of a, uh, combinations, okay? And I have them in eViews and um, in Stata. And they are all with their interpretation. So I've done a lot of work here for you. I've, I've, I've helped you to interpret your results. So just adapt whatever you are seeing here uh, into your study. Next, I have threshold regression models. I did a lot of work here too on threshold regression uh, using Stata. Okay. And um, very detailed, very detailed. I covered a lot of grounds. Static threshold, dynamic threshold, uh, using the XT range. Um, command, different specifications. You can see number one to five. Very interesting. So if you want to do threshold analysis, I will suggest that you enroll into PEBA and just follow what I did, honestly. Then I have quantile regression, also detailed. Here also I was able to use uh, eViews and Stata for quantile regression. So eViews users, you have something here going for you. And you can see it's also logged. So only enrollees have access to this. Next, I did a uh, quadratic modeling, intro to quadratic modeling. I was able to get state and eViews all together here. Very interesting. You also love what you see and it's also locked, but if you enroll, you'll be able to open and access. Then again, I moved on to dummy variables. Also very, very, very interesting. Um, in dummy variables, I think I have this one that anyone can preview, which is the introduction. You can see, and I also have the one for panel data introduction is uh, free for viewing. So like I said, public preview shows that uh, it's free to watch. While the rest are locked, but if you're an enrollee, you'll be able to access them once you have 
uh, registered for the course. So dummy variables, if you're having challenges with dummy variables, I will advise you to enroll into PEBA and get your job done. For dummy variables, uh oh, I clicked something now. Let me just go back. I mistakenly clicked something. Uh oh, okay, good. So for dummy variables, I was able to cover cross section panel data. So I'm still going to upload the one for time series. Okay. So time series is still outstanding. I will get to, I will get to do that very soon. So dummy variables, you have it there. Moderation modeling. This is one of my best techniques ever, honestly. I love moderation modeling so much, so much. Most of my papers, most of my recent publications, 2020, 2020 to date, I don't think I can write a paper without doing moderation modeling. I'm not sure I can. I'm not sure. I have so much uh, publications or so many publications where I use moderation modeling. And I will encourage you to do the same. It will spice up your analysis. It will spice up your research, honestly. So moderation model is there, very detailed in status and e-views. I have it in panel data and I have it in time series. So many. I covered a lot of grants because I'm familiar with it. I covered a lot of ground. So only the intro is free to watch. While the rest, you have to, you know, you have to enroll for you to access it. Ah, this is another interesting one, contemporaneous correlation techniques. I think this is about the last one I uploaded, PCSC and FGLS. And this is open to you guys, you see, free. This is free to watch. <laughs> This is free to watch, but I will encourage you to enroll, but this is free to watch, okay? So this is like a bonus to all of you. So this is, an, this is what I have on Teachable right now. These are my PEBA videos, as you can see, nothing hidden. I've shown you what I have. So if you want to know what's on PEBA, this is it. These are the videos. So you can decide to make up your mind and uh, upgrade, upskill. This is a new year, 2024. Don't lag behind. Get to know more skills, uh, get to enhance yourself, and you will be better off. At the moment, you can see here certificates. I'm still working on giving certificates to people, but right now, certificates are not issued. So you are going to learn at your pace, okay? Learn at your pace. And there's something I need to mention. For anybody enrolling into the PEBA, you are going to have access to free data sets, free data do file, you are going to have access to articles, you know, to support the empirical technique that I discussed. And you have access to posting your comments on the platform. And I respond within uh, 24 to 48 hours. I respond. <laughs> you know me. My turnaround time, <laughs> I respond. So those are, the benefit, those are the benefits you are going to have if you buy my teachable course. Okay. If you buy my teachable course, Access to free data set, access to state do file, access to the articles that you can use to support your technique. And, um, you have access to post your comments and I give you more expose, give you more insight into your query. Again, my name is Dr. Ngozi Adjeleye, creator, founder, tutor, crunch econometrics. And here I am reintroducing PEBA which I curated on the Teachable platform. These are premium videos at the cost of $200. Don't miss it. I hope to see you in my school. Thank you and have a great day. Bye.